Hello, curious kids! It's another fun day for learning English. It is me, Teacher Suzette May and Phil Silda, or you can call me Teacher Zetty. I will be guiding you for the lesson in English 1, Quarter 3, Module Number 1. But oops! Before we start, you should get ready with your English module, paper or notebook, pencil, and your crayons. You should also abide with our class rules. You should listen to your teacher attentively. Do all of the activities. Finish the class or the video lesson. And of course, enjoy learning! In this lesson, you will be able to learn the following. Recognize rhyming words in nursery rhymes, poems, and songs heard. You will be also able to Recite rhyming words with ease and be able to write rhyming words correctly. Our lesson for today is Meet Rhyme. Recognize rhyming words in nursery rhymes, poems, songs heard. Now, Get your notebook or paper and your pencil for our first activity. Let us try. If the pair of words are with the same sound, write Y, E, S or ES. And if not, write N, O or NO on the space provided or on your paper. Now here are the following pair of words. Do they sound the same? Number one, coat, boat. Number two, car, van. Number three, man, rat. Number four, fun, run. And number five, Fat, sad. Do they sound the same? Yes or no? Your time is up. Let us now check your answer. Let us check your answer. Number one. Coat, boat. The answer is yes, they sound the same. Number two, car, van. The answer is no, they don't sound the same. Number three, man, rat. The answer is no, they don't have the same sound. Number four, fun, run. Yes, they sound the same. Number five, fat, sad. Yes, they sound the same. Great! How is your score for the first activity? Did you get all the answers correctly? If yes, congratulations! If no, don't worry. We have more activities for you. This time, I will ask you, how good are you in your listening skills? Let us study. We are going to examine the pair of words, listen very carefully as I read it, and repeat it after me. Are you ready? Let us start. Number one. Hat, cat. Again, hat, cat. 
number two. House, mouse. Again, house, mouse. Number three, knitten, kitten. Again, knitten, kitten. Number four, pan, can. Again, pan, can. Number five, pin, bin. Again, pin, bin. Do you have your crayons handy? Because we are going to try your thinking skills. Let's do this. Notice the pictures given. Color the box red. If they are rhyming words or they have the same sound. And color the box blue if they are not. Are you ready? Let's start! Number one. Can. Mitten. What are you going to color the box? Number two. Bin. Pin. Are you going to color the box blue or red? Number three, mouse, house. What are you going to color the box? You may start answering now. Let's check your answer for number one. Can, mitten. What color will it be? Yes, it's color blue. They don't sound the same. Number two, bin, pin. Yes, it's going to be color red because they have the same sound. Number three, house, mouse. That's another red because they have the same sound. How are you doing, kids? Did you get all the answers correctly? If yes, very good. If no, do not worry. We have more activities for you. Okay, kids, let us practice more. Select a word from the box, which have the following words. None, goat, and fox. That rhymes with the following below and kindly write your answer on the blank provided. You can do it, kids! For number one, which Word rhymes with boat. Number two. Which word rhymes with box? And number three. Which word have the same sound with sun? You may start answering now. If you feel you need more time, you can hit the pause button. Good luck, kids! Your time is up. Let us now check your answer. Let us see if you have the correct answer. For number one, boat rhymes with goat. Boat, goat. They have the same sound. Box, fox. Box, fox. Number three. Sun and none. They have the same sound. They are rhymes. How are you doing, little champ? How is your score? Did you get all the three correct answers? If yes, you're amazing. If no, we will 
try again. Maybe you will do better in the next activity. Now, hey there, buddy. It is now time to remember. Kindly read the sentence inside the heart shape and supply the missing word to complete it. Good luck! Rhyming words are two or more words that have the same ending blank. What is the correct answer? Can you supply it? Let's go! Your time is up! Let us now check your answer. And the missing word is sound. Correct! Rhyming words are two or more words that have the same ending sound. Very good, kids! Everybody loves to hear a nursery rhyme. It's nursery rhyme time! Let us now hear and sing along with a nursery rhyme entitled Humpty Dumpty. Let's go! Humpty sat on a wall, Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall, Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses and all the king's men. Now let us check if you have learned about rhymes. Let us do this next activity. You are going to encircle the words with the same sound from the nursery rhyme Humpty Dumpty. Now that you are finished, let us check your answer. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's purses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. And the rhyming words are wall and fall. Very good, kids! Okay, kids. I know that you will love to hear another nursery rhyme. So it's nursery rhyme time again! Let us now hear another famous song entitled Rain, Rain, Go Away. Are you ready? Let's go! <laughs> Good job, kids! 
How do you feel singing another wonderful song? Now, prepare your pencil and paper or notebook because we are going to have another activity. After singing the song, Rain, Rain, Go Away, you are going to write down the pair of rhyming words on your paper. Are you ready? Let's go! Time's up, little champ. Now, let us check your answer. Rain, rain, go away. Come again another day. We have away and day. The rhyming words are away and day. Very good. Next is little Johnny wants to play. Rain, rain, go away. We have the words play and away. That's the answer for number two. Play and away. Good job, kids! Now it's time to recite a poem. We are going to recite a poem entitled The Fat Cat. After reciting, Write down the pair of rhyming words or words with the same sound on the space provided or on your paper. You can do this! Now let us recite the poem entitled The Fat Cat. Let's do it all together. I had a cat who was so fat. He could not even sit on his mat. He had a hat that did not fit. He put it on and then it split. Did you follow? Very good. Very good, champ. Thank you for answering the activity. Now we are going to check if you have the correct answers, let us examine the poem, The Fat Cat. Here are the list of rhyming words. Cat rhymes with fat. Cat, fat, sounds the same. Next is mat. Rhymes with hat. Mat, hat, sounds the same. Fit, split. Fit and split are rhyming words. Do you also have the same answers? Very good, champ! Wow, we are now ending our lesson. I would like to congratulate all of you for actively engaging in each of the activities. You are all a champion! And always remember, kids, that two or more words that have the same ending sounds are called rhyming words. And also, never ever forget that listening to the loadable children's songs is a great help in your listening skills, though it takes time to master it. But... What is really very important is that you are slowly learning and willing to improve yourself. That's a great milestone for you. And also, good luck with learning more rhyming words in your daily life. Now that we have come to the end of the lesson, this is Teacher Sadie saying that learning is more fun when we have more Rhyming words under the sun. Be always good, kids. See you around.